This is a single table join index. When you first see this, you might say, why would I do that? But this is very clever in how this might work. Here we say create join index, give it a name, emp idx, as I'm selecting employee number, department, first name, last name, salary from the employee table, but I'm giving it a different primary index. The real table has employee number as the primary index, as an OOPI, unique primary index, but this has department number as the primary index. We've just created a single table join index. Next, we'll figure out why we did this. I love a single table join index. And I'll give you some reasons as we go along, but this is really important. If you're going to be able to understand and follow what I'm saying, you really do have a good handle on what you're doing here. Now, let's talk about the employee table and then we'll talk about the single table join index that we created. In our employee table up here, I've got this just on the single amp. The primary index is employee number. If someone says, select everything where employee number is equal to 2 million, it's a single amp retrieve and that's fantastic. But unfortunately, if someone queries on department number, it's a full table scan. Now, secondly, when I join the employee table to the department table where depno equals depno, the employee table has to be redistributed by department number because depno and depno are how they join. And for two rows to join, they have to be on the same amp in the same memory. So the join index serves two purposes. It's a single table join index where we made the primary index depno. So, if someone queries and says select everything where employees equal to 2 million, the parsing engine says that's the primary index of the employee table, use it. But if someone queries and says select everything where department number is equal to 200, the parsing engine says, hold on, don't use the employee table use the single table join index because now that's a single amp retrieve because the primary index of that is department number. And if someone says, I would like to join the employee table to the department table, the parsing engine says, hold on a second. Don't use the employee table. Use the join index because now both primary indexes from department table and the join index are department number and we're joining on department number and so there's going to be no data movement. The join's going to happen extremely quickly. That, my friends, is the brilliance of a single table join index. This lesson is brought to you by Coughing Data Warehousing. The next is Query Chameleon, a query tool looking to help your data adapt to any surroundings. Hi, this is Tom Coffing. Thank you so much for watching the video. Please hit subscribe to make sure you are kept up to date on all our videos.